ladies and gentlemen, world first Black Swan Unlock has arrived at your doorstep. All you've got to do in order to unlock your own big booba goth girlfriend, aka Black Swan, is beat her in her world boss legend plus 10 times. And we have done it on the first two available days. Now, for so many other reasons, you absolutely want to be playing Black Swan every single day. So if you're not interested in unlocking her or seeing how much she costs, watch the end of this video anyways, because the next video is going to give you advice on how to beat her and a first look at her fight as well and all of the tips and tricks that I've accumulated for you guys battling and testing and trialing different teams against her. So not to mention, right? Not to mention the fact you're looking at 54 carbonadium from a single run of world boss of the day so absolutely huge there we also hit our titan book uh pity so we're ready to collect that but i'll leave that for later because right now we've got a waifu to build oh not to mention tier four materials from it, uh, achievements yes sir i've now collected this twice for a total of 50 carbonadium it's not much but it's an honest living now here we go unlocking the black swan the newest native tier 3 super villain i'm really excited for this one for the main reason that she is a speed villain i've been saying this for a long time speed characters have been neglected in pvp and you know 3rl said it and her stats and her and her skills and her passive say it she is built she is made for pvp so we're gonna build her up and maybe try to find out if that is the case now, we have 250 million gold right now. Keep keep a close eye on that gold because it's about to be going way down. Uh, so we're going to level her up as all native tier threes go. And I, I mean, I can't really remember because I guess Kang was the last one like six months ago or something. But you can use bios or materials. So you can use black antimatter if you want. I do believe there's a bit of a discount if you use black antimatter compared to bios. So I would say for most players, you should just use black antimatter. I mean, unless you're really um, lacking a lot of that, you should absolutely do that. Now, we do need speed records to do her mastery. So keep in mind, if you're looking to tier three a speed type recently, that you're going to have to put that on the back burner uh, for Black Swan if you want to get her max mastery all maxed out so that you can start working on her first potential, get her to level 70, and then really dip her toes into PvP because she's probably not going to be too potent in pvp until she can at least get that uh 60 tier 3 if not 70 tier 3 so now we need six of these bad boys i don't remember how much these cost let's find out here 1.5 million okay that's actually not too bad i'll say that's not too bad and then the rank up itself is 1.2 okay so we're, we're probably about 3 million deep so far not bad uh yeah about two and a half million deep so far not not too bad not too bad we're gonna rank her up again here we need five of the triangles oh we also need another book here very nice I can't remember if you need 10 or 11 books for the full rank up here. So that book selector is actually going to come in super duper clutch. But let's go ahead and see here. We need five of these diamonds. I'm going to go ahead and combine. I'm going to do the auto combine. You have to be very careful with the auto combine. Never hit the max button, guys. This will kill you. Look at that. That will literally put me in more debt than the U.S. government. Okay. Uh, we have five of the triangles. Very nice. I wasn't even paying attention to how much that was. 1.8 million for the rank up itself we get death pirouette very nice okay so we spent 10 million so far so guys it's just 10 million to get a three-star character no biggie <laughs> no biggie we get the mastery as well very nice and now we need four of the gigantic oh no we gotta level her up first okay level her up it would be 400 actually 400 bios is not bad to be honest 400 bios is not bad so you could you you could honestly use bios that's actually not bad we need four of the gigantic cubes or squares. Okay, that's nine million gold. Jeez, jeez, bro. And then another 2.4. So that's 11.4 just for the four star rank up. And now, and now we're suddenly at 228 million. I think we're going to end off at about 150 when we're done, but I could be wrong. I hope it's more than 150. I haven't dipped. Well, I haven't dipped below 100 million in a long time. That's 870 bios. You know what? That's not that many bios. I'm just going to use the bios. I really don't need the bios. Princess of the Hidden City. Guests of the World Library and then Destroyer from Another World. Cool. I like the little um, the names there. We've got uh, three of the um, pentagrams or whatever they're. Pentagons? I don't know what they're called. I think they're pentagons. Uh, three? Three of these bad boys? Uh, no, are they, I think they're hexagons, actually. Not pentagons. It's Penta's five, and those are six. I think those are hexagons. 
Anyways, that's why I don't pay attention in geometry class when I was like 10 years old. Uh, yeah, so we are gonna need 12 books. It looks like. Yep, we're gonna need we're gonna need more books. We're gonna need more. We're gonna need more wax. That's what she's. Whoa, buddy! If I wasn't paying attention, so it just massively ramps here from like 500 bios to 2,000. Yeah, you gotta be super careful. It ramps up to a crazy number of bios. I probably still could have used the bios, but uh, I just wanted to show you guys what it looks like without. And then we need two of these sphere things. They're actually. Look, look more like diamond kind of things that's 22 million gold <coughs> okay sure true yeah uh-huh sure holy shit and then 3.6 million for the last rank up holy 22 million there we go i'm under 100 i'm under 200 million wow 182 wow so we're close to 100 we're close to 100 million so far starting at 250 uh we gotta go level her up one more time wow four thousand bios if you want to use bios or three thousand three hundred black antimatter i'll take the black antimatter thank you i mean i'm farming like what 150 so if you're farming a black swan every day she drops about 150 every run she can farm 750 uh in a day right so in less than a week of farming i get in, in a week of farming just black swan world boss i get over five thousand black antimatter so just use black antimatter, guys. I don't know why I'm saying to use bios. Just use black antimatter. It's it's so much easier, bro. You you can't farm 5,000 bios a week just by playing world boss. Bios are so much harder to farm. Yeah, never ever use bios, guys, for these native tier threes. I don't know why I ever suggested otherwise. And then the last mastery requires two more. Oh, it's actually 12 books. So it's two more books. Now, normally I would be screwed here. I would have to go and buy a $30 pack, which gives you books, right? But with the recent changes, really nice here. I can use the selector. I can go into my inventory and now I pop this selector and I choose a speed book, which is really nice. I'm actually also going to check my inventory. Oh, I have to collect it again. Sorry. I'm also going to check my inventory if I have any book selectors that are expiring. I do not. Okay. But now you're like, Alex, you're one short. Uh, are you sure that everything's okay with your brain? Yes, I am. Because the event shop. Yes, sir. Oh, we get the event shop Titan record selector. We choose another speed book. Mwah. So yeah, the speed book, uh, pity. From world boss is is very good it's a very very good change um i know i've uh, talked a lot of shit about this update already in such a short time and i stand by a lot of what i said but that one change is very very good so there you go boys level 60 six star black schwan but we're not done we're not done no we have a lot more gold to burn through let's go gaze of destruction so uh we got 1.860 i think it's different for each gear yeah, it's slightly different for each gear. I think the first gear is more expensive. Let's go ahead. That looks like a light. That looks like a like a, a, a car light, a street light for cars. You know, with a red and... Anyways, I don't know what it's called, guys. Uh, and now we got to do gear 20 here. Let's see. Two. We want, like, I don't know if... I don't know. Do you want to see high rolls here? Do you want to see low rolls? I, I feel like if I see low rolls here, like, these lo low rolls are great. 28. Holy shit. 28 on that last gear hang on it was 120 gold 120,000 gold per roll and i hit 28 that was just 3.3 million gold on that one gear okay cool yeah that's cool i don't need the gold sure what do i need the gold for um anyways what i was saying was i, I get a little paranoid that if you see a lot of low rolls on these gears for like tier two characters and stuff um then you're you know you're basically saving the uh low rolls that you could have gotten on a tier four now, obviously, that's just my own, you know, superstition, but I don't know, man. You tell me. You tell me. I mean, these rolls have not been low, so I don't really care <laughs> if I got that 28 roll on Gladiator Tier 4 or, like, Angel Tier 4. I'd probably have a hernia, uh, but thankfully, we're just doing a Tier 2 and, uh, or Tier 3, sorry, and we're just wasting these materials that I have infinite of, these uh, these Tier 3 materials. So, yeah. Pretty good end there after after rolling the, the high roll stuff there. But now we're down to 163. So that was another 20 million on the gears. So the gears and the level have cost me just shy of 100 million gold. We're talking 87, 86 million gold. Now, you will see a little dot above her artifact. I want to point this out for you guys in the video because I wasn't able to show you because I cleared stage 10 already. Yes. You do get her artifact for free through World Boss Legend. This is huge. 
there was speculation there was unclear patch notes we weren't sure if it was just gene and kang or also black swan it is also black swan so save your selectors save your crystals don't gamble you can get this baby absolutely for free stage 10 20 and 30 are going to drop the four star variety 40 and 50 and 60 are going to drop the five star variety and then 70 80 90 will drop the six star variety just like ultron gore and gene and kang so really nice stuff i didn't expect them to do this so soon like basically with the update i thought they would at least delay it by a few months or delay it until i don't know the next world boss or something because they they can't stop themselves from adding world bosses but that's actually a huge bonus um to this character i'm i'm kind of tempted to equip it because i don't know how quickly i'm gonna be able to get up to stage 40 she's a pretty difficult boss um but at the same time i don't want to equip it and then get a better one and then just be like ah oh, i guess i just have to unequip it. i mean yeah i guess i will equip it i guess i will equip it. for the time being it's a, it's better to showcase it like this than not at all and it's only 14 percent, right she's not tier four so she's not going to get that crazy instinct bonus the difference between this and a six star version um is only six percent right for the hero and villain damage so you you do get the majority of it you get the you still get a, a good chunk more than 50 percent of the total value of the artifact at four stars now do i want to re-roll it i'll consider that later but for now let's see how much gold it's going to cost me to re-roll her iso set that wasn't too bad at all so we started with about 63 163.6 i think and it only cost us yeah it cost me like two million gold that was easy peasy let's go ahead and equip all these now around about seven or eight million gold later and we've got this fully maxed out but i do have to re-roll this last iso because she's not a physical attacker be careful with that she is a an energy attacker so you want all attack on this uh, powerful iso just to remind you guys because it's pretty rare that we get speed types that are not physical attackers um it's very very rare so i wanted to remind you guys yeah she is an energy attacker she has pretty nice stats and i'm already in the top almost in the top 10 which is pretty dope a hey, commander's there wow but almost more than double my um growth score is crazy so not that many people rushing to build black swan interesting here um we do have her uh we do have her uh uru left so let me go ahead and see how much it's going to cost me from 154 million to fully amplify her uru slots last year screwed me a little bit but still not bad overall we're just around 145.5 million gold so just a shade over 100 mil with the nine digit cost to build up black swan I'm really happy with that we're rank nine now let's set up the uru and see where it gets us with the uru all set up and four heal odin's blessings we're now looking at just under 58,000 energy attack decent defenses and a whopping 117,000 hp that's pretty good but i completely forgot about her skills so that you know 105 million gold is actually going to be a lot more than that so 3.3 6.6 9.9 13 yeah 15 and change so there you go 130 million so yeah now it's cost us 120 million to build her up 121 to be more precise but that does leave us with a rank 7 black swan which is not bad at all considering we still haven't given her a custom gear now i'll leave this for another video to start doing testing but hit me up in the comments down below let me know what you think of the goth mommy was she worth it or are you going to save your resources for somebody else thanks so much for watching smash the like button it helps with the channel and i'll see you in the next one take care